Hi. I'm late again. I'm just here to go to the theater district personally. Which, what even is the theater district? Is this it? I don't need to go to the PA. I just have to go to the district. They're all districts. Okay. So, few things. Few things. Throw this out here. One. I've been late like the past four, four days. Either that or I just have not streamed, period. I need to fucking sort myself out or else I, I, I'm i just going to start crying. Uh, second. I am so, so close to done with best of 2023. So close. Like, I'm, I'm just going to go back through a little bit. Throw a little bit more pizzazz in here and there. And then from that point, I'm going to, uh, ba ba ba. What is it? Fucking. I'm going to record the outro, which is like the easiest part. Uh huh. Oh. These guys want to hustle. And then I have the, uh,. I have the outro, or not the outro. I have the uh, thumbnail already made. So I'll be fine in that regard. And then I'll have it go up on the uh, the main in quotations channel, which isn't really the main channel anymore because I never upload on it. What was that thing? And there it goes. And then I'll have truly no excuse to be up at four in the morning. It's the right place. No, it, it doesn't seem like it. Over, I, I will purchase a beef bowl. Yummy. Yum, yum. Okay, yeah, there's, there's nothing in here. Oh, can I talk to this dude? Oh, okay. Alright. Cool, man. Whatever you say. Whatever you say. Um... Uh, also, uh, I might finally... We're getting closer and closer to... Getting an understanding as to what the fuck is going on with my... Consistent... Nightmares, night terrors, whatever they are. Uh, according to some some people, it's a form of sleep paralysis, which is also not fun. Oh, hello, gentlemen. Oh, these are just straight up Yakuza. There we go. All right. Good night, buddy. Get ready to slumber. Okay, so I need to... I need to find... That's the bowling alley, isn't it? I'm not being trapped back in there. You're not convincing me to play another game. You can't make me... Um... Where's the door? Is this the right place? Yes, I'm okay. It's not the right place. I want to see Q drink an entire gallon of milk, just like in the middle of combat, a whole gallon of milk. Vomit all over my enemies. Alright, so the game is telling me, hey, uh, the, they called from, like, this restaurant, like, the theater district or something like that. You should probably go check that out. And I, I, I'm trying to, but it's just, I can't find the place. I'm, I'm struggling.
You know, I have all this this money here. Hey, I got another achievement. Isn't that nice? Intimidate the enemy to fill the heat gouge and frighten them. Okay. I feel like I could use that against enemies. That would be kind of useful. I don't have an idea as to what I'm going to do with all this. It's more of just a case of I would like to have a bit more variety should like the need arise, you know? Okay. Um uh, hey dude. Okay. Huh? One of the businesses he bought out. That's that's useful information at all if I fucking knew where I was going. Alright. Uh Yeah, okay. It's just straight up not showing me like where this place could could be. If I had to guess, it'd probably be the theater square itself. Where am I even on the map? Ah. Yeah. Alright. Fantastic. Yeah, if I had to venture a guess, it would either be on Theater Ave or, or Theater Square. One of the two. Oh, God damn it. Alright. Only, only two of you? Let's try out the new one. Oh, there's a the third guy. Oh, damn. Oh! I think that made my guy hit into a coma. Alright, no, 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 I'm not going back in there to get robbed by the fucking claw machine. That's not happening again. Let's try to tempt me in with the sounds of video game. Won't work. It won't work. Again? Who? Where? These guys were right behind me? I think I'm getting used to this whole rush dial. It's not perfect, but... Oh! I'm sad that I can't go into here because this looks like the most interesting place on the on the planet.
Oh yeah, that's just like the side. Uh, do the menu. Um. Uh... That's some teriyaki and egg. Why not? <laughs> Mouth watering. Yeah, I don't know where I'm going currently. What? Huh? Oh. Hello. How you doing, fellas? Come here, you. That was not a very interesting way to fight him, but we did it nonetheless. What? My control is rumbling again. Uh, is that because of the alcohol? It might also be because of these guys. I think I just prefer brawler style because I get to do the whole cutscene thing more. Like, come on. You telling me that that's not fun? Hoping that this controller rumbling is just the alcohol in my system. Oh wait, maybe it is the bowling alley. Because I remember it mentioning a place called Mock Bowl. This place is Mock Bowl. Oh god, has my have they tarnished my beloved bowling alley? You. Who's tarnished my beloved bowling alley? Hello. I got the floor over there. Uh, I don't know if I really want that. Like, I, I, I really don't know if I want that. Was it mock bowl or mock blend? Don't make me beat you at fucking bowling again just to get answers, okay? Don't make me do it. Don't make me do it. Alright, here. Maybe on the map I can find something. Fuck bowl. That one just says Vincent. I just had a can. I'm sorry, where's my phone? I have to look up where the fuck to go.
Okay. Thank you, game. So, I think I have to go... Well, wow, okay. <laughs> we found the content. Hey there, buddy. Been looking for you. You again. You've got a lot of nerve showing up now. What do you want? I think it's pretty clear what I want. Time to pay your protection buddy, pal. If you're doing business in... Hamarocho, you're doing business with us. The hell with that. It's not protection buddy if you don't show up to actually protect me when I need it. And you have the gall to ask for more? When you need it? What are you talking about? I'm talking about Tachibana Real Estate. When they came and chased me out, you people were nowhere in sight. Some protection. Tachibana? What? Oh, Tachibana Real Estate. Yeah, there. Look, it's complicated. Complicated my ass. You, you got scared and ran away. What could be simpler? Scared? Who do you think? Thanks to you, I had to relocate. Now I'm scrambling to get new customers to make up for all the ones I lost. I couldn't even pay you if I wanted to. I think you better keep that attitude check, asshole. Mind if I cut in? Huh? What do you want? Who are you? What, do you, what family are you with? I'm not anybody's family. And pipe down, it's this guy I'm talking to. Excuse me? What do you want from me? You say you opened shop here because Tachibana Real Estate forced you out of your last location. Is that right? Oh, I see what this is. You're trying to be this guy's new muscle. Oh, hell no. What? Our family's handled this cafe's protection for 30 years. You try to swoop it on our turf, it, it'll be war. Looks like you need some convincing to stay quiet when I speak to the owner here. Shut your mouth and try me. I'll kill you. The dude in the back has disappeared. All right, champ. A little bit of rough house and never hurt. All right, let's get it. Come here, champ. And die. What, what the hell? I'm not losing this some kid. You just did. Now get lost and don't show your face around this guy's shop again. Damn it. This ain't over. I'm opening up my root beer. There, now we can finally talk in peace. So what? Is he just taking his place as the, as the guy squeezed me for protection, Mike? Please, can you just leave me alone? I already said it wasn't like that. Not even Yakuza. I just really want to talk for a minute. Talk about what? Talk to you about a real estate. I'm doing a little investigation. I'd like you to tell me what you know. Anything is fine. What I know is the hell of a lot. Besides, I prefer never to deal with those guys again. They're terrified. Terrifying how? What did they do to you? Not even what they did. They just knew about me. Like, everything about me. Like what? My parents' home... <coughs> my parents' home address, my daughter's school, where I source all the cafe supplies, who my customers are. With that much ammo, they didn't have to do anything. And at, at the top it off, they're not even Yakuza. At least with that lot, you know what to expect. Let's see. And where would I want... Where would I go if I wanted to meet the guy from Tachibana's offices who paid you that visit? They're probably still there, finishing what they started. Still where? The Hakua building on... Shichifuku Street. The place my cafe was in. They threw most of the tenants out, so the place is practically empty. There's one stubborn guy who said the only way he was leaving was in a casket. He's still there? Probably. They're making him all kinds of sweet deals, but he turned down every, every last one. If he's still in there now, Tachibana's boys will be too. Go have a look if you want to get mixed up with them. Alright, thanks. I appreciate it. Tachibana's running tenants out of the, out of the Hakuo building on... Oh god, I'm not even going to try to fucking say it. It's worth checking out. Yes, it is. Onward. To adventure. Justice for Gotham. Am I going to have to beat up another, like, man on the street before I get there? 
I prefer to like spend the like at least five minutes without having to brutally assault a man on the street with me mitts, with me fist, with me, me, me fist of fury. God damn it. Just let me walk around the corner. Now I have to red through your ass cheeks. All right, champ, let's go. One on one. Fight me. Come on. Oh, he's best. Oh, come on. Come get it. Come get it. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. I'll be on my way now. I don't even really know why there are cars here. God damn it! Alright, rush style, let's go. I'm in crunch time here. a highly illegal street fighting tactic you never stop on somebody's face when they're down mm -mm. not a fan of that one kill you no no bad 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 ex yakuza i spray you with like a thing of water Looks like this is the place Tachibon Real Estate's been trying to buy up. Now the question is, why would they even want it? No business sides. It seems Tachibana's boys live up to the rumors. Alright. We got one holdout. Alright, let's check out. All right, man. I don't know what that says. Hey. Assuming that's the owner. <laughs> せなら立花不動産にこの Turn up the game volume a little bit. Taki I didn't shit his own. Ah, I killed a monday. Kono Biro no Hokano Misa Mo, Tajibana of those and Tajinoka Saritanka. Ah, Arutoki, Kuni Tajibana of those and Lakite, Kono Biro no owner in Atagara, Zain did a get this. Nakanya Tajibana of those and the Kita Daka, Miss Shimeria to me. No got the no Mo Uchidake. Oh god, no. Oh, 
奥から出てこなくなったよ。連中よこしたのも立花不動産の嫌がらせ。ホームレスにビルの中で小便させたり、ああ、はめかせたり。不審火まで出しやがる。So they're paying them to keep this place empty, basically. 最近来るのは無言電話だけ。気を通し何百回ってかかってくるよ。誰だ Oh, did he rat on me? Did he tell people that I'm here? Perfect, I can handle them. Oh, he's talking to the Hitman. I don't know what he Filthy Diaz shoes, okay. God, doing all that work in those loafers must suck. Oda san. Domo, Namase san. Doska, Tachinoki no ken, Kangai de Kremasta. Ucha de de Ikimasen yo. So I demo. Konobirua mo uchina ona ni not deru agadashi. カッテナツゴを並べて居座られちゃ困っちゃうんだよなだからって毎日毎日嫌がらせしやがってうちにアカンボだっているんだぞみない顔だけどそちらさんはねえ生瀬さんこんなヤクザに耐えるとあとが
I really want to fight in this dude's house. この店閉めて出ていくのか。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ
Sorry. Although I also have this contact card thing. It's not appearing in here, but I had it. Am I able to do the porn speed run? I wonder if that's an actual category, like on speedrun.com. Yakuza Zero erotic video percent. Just make sure. Yeah, that still works. Fantastic. Hello there. Welcome to the Gantar. Yeah. Oh my god. There is no way this is genuine porn, right? I'm gonna mute the game in the background. There's no way this is actual. Oh god. Oh god. There's no way. <laughs> oh my god! There is no fucking way. I mean, okay, it's- there's no nudity. There is no nudity. It's just- I mean, great, you know what? If Twitch streamers can get away with it, so can I! It- it- it-, it okay, maybe not that. Maybe not that part. Just keep the clothes on, man, please. Oh god, no, 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 mm-mm. No, we're good. This is- this is- this is the worst experience of my fucking life. Why- why does this game have a porn- porn minigame? Get me the fuck. Huh? I- I- I've paused the game. I just fucking yanked my spank. It's technically a style of video. Okay, and a gun is just a style to murder a man. Fuck me, right? <laughs> oh, hey, it's you again. Uh, milk. You want some milk? Have some milk. How about this? Mm. Like, straight up, straight up, why did we need that? Why did I need the jack-off minigame? Tap square to make sure you bust your load. Oh, hello, fellas. All right, Can we turn it up. Turn me up then. Come on. Come on. Alright, how do I get this guy into like a weird spot? Into the trash cans. Or, no, venting machine. I cannot believe that just happened. Like, I. I we, we've had a lot of weird experiences on the stream, but. Oh, sh oh shit. Yo, stop. I'm intervening. I know there's another group of assholes right behind me, but... Come on, then. Come on, then. He was talking all that good shit a second ago. A ruby plate? What the fuck am I gonna do with this? I can sell it? Alright. Cool, I guess. 
Wait, wait a second. Why was that dude carrying around the full ass ruby plate? Who does that? Oh, I have questions now. I have questions that. I'm hearing stuff. I'm hearing stuff, but I'm not seeing stuff. I'm hearing stuff, but I'm not seeing stuff. That sounds, that sounds bad. Where? Is it over here? No, that's the homeless dudes. Somebody's in danger, I have to save them. Fire in the hole. Uh, um, god damn it. You motherfucker, I'm busy. Oh, there she is. I think we found her. I'm busy. Somebody needs my help. Get out of my way! I've gone all around the place. And I I think we lost it. Oh man. What? Where are we? Which cutscene is this? Uh... Where's the producer? If he doesn't show up for the location shoot today, we're screwed. Well, he had that huge market with the director at the last shoot, remember? He's probably still butthurt. Yeah, our director is something else. He won't budge an inch, even when it means butting heads with the producer. Our law of the crew can't deal with him either. Maybe it'll be a strike. Well, whatever the reason, if we try to shoot on location without the producer, the director is going to really boil over. Maybe we can find someone who can stand in for him. Oh, sure. Someone who can stay calm and cool while taking all the crap out our director dishes out. We need a guy with an aura of toughness. A guy who can command respect just by being in the room. I guess guys like that aren't exactly a dime a dozen, huh? Yeah, you're right. Not a guy who can do that is just going to waltz down the street. Ass. Huh? Hey, look. That bull Demeter. That aura of unassailable authority and that faint hint of danger. That's our man, the puzzle child of a producer who walked into the scene and into our lives. Wait, please. I, wait, I'm savior. I mean, you, sir. You with the cool aura and magnificent poise. Yes, yes, I mean you. May I have a minute? We're a production, production crew for a TV show. What a television crew want from me? Well, we're going to be shooting a short segment at a restaurant here in in town for our gourmet food program. But we're down a bit and we're desperate. Will you help us? What? How could someone who doesn't know the first thing about show business be useful to you? No, oh, no, no. With the, with an aura that magnificent, you don't have to do anything but stand there and look authorita authoritative. Authoritative? Whoa, I, I can't see your aura so bright. It's dazzling. This reeks of BS. No, honestly, we're not trying to pull your leg. We're deadly sincere about this. We'll do all the heavy lifting. Well, actually, we may ask you to move things and help us some of the simpler tasks, but... Help a guy on a TV show, huh? I guess that's not something everyone gets to experience. Please, it has to be. No one else can do this. They aren't kidding about being desperate. Should I help? Yep, yep, yep. I'll help out. Fine, I'll help out. If it's not going to take too long. <laughs> that's great. Thank you very much. Oh, my name is Mori. I'm the, 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 the director's assistant. And this is Kawaguchi, our cameraman. Hi, I'm Kawaguchi. Delighted to meet you. I'm Kiryu. Good to meet you. So what am I supposed to do? Well, the show's producer is supposed to be here, but something came up in the last minute. He can't make it. So we need you to stand in for him, Kiryu said. Wait, what? I don't know what, producer, what a producer does, but isn't that role pretty important? No way. You might think that, but all a producer really does is act high and mighty. It's a, t it's a total fluff job. Is that it? I have no idea what I'm doing, but... Though, well, pe people know I'm faking it, won't they? Not to worry. Once we get you to some clothes with a more executive style, you'll totally pass for a producer. Do producers have a look? Sure they do. Now let's get you looking like a b b big shot. The funny? 
Oh my god. I look like Chad from Friday the 13th. Oi. Guys, do producers seriously dress like this? <laughs> Absolutely. You're a per per picture perfect producer. Isn't that right, Kawaguchi said? <clears throat> this does not seem right. Uh, okay, so what am I supposed to do? Well, our director is on the way, and all we need to do is deal with him and keep up with his demands. He can be, a uh, kind of a diva. And he says some weird stuff, but try not to set him off and you'll be fine. I'm having second thoughts here, but I'll see what I can do. Alright, let's, uh, let's, let's try this out. We should be here at any minute now. Oh, the director's here. Here he comes. Kiri said, you're up. Try to act natural. Act okay. natural. Got it. Hideo Kojima? <laughs> yeah, lovelies. Good morning. Good morning, Chad. Guten Morgen, baby. Uh, Guten Morgen to you, too. Do it ever change, Mori Chad. I'm counting on you today. Bling, bling, cha ching, baby. Oi. What in the blazes? Where's our intrepid producer? Where's my Lita Chan? S sorry, Lita Chan called us sick this morning. You said here will be standing in for him today. Aww. Hear you? Never heard of him. He's the he the real deal, baby. Yes, of course. You said there's a lot of. Of work on location overseas. This is his first domestic shoot in a while. That's probably probably why you don't recognize him. Very well then. C'est la vie. <laughs> yeah, I don't care who you are. When you're on location with me, everyone has to pull their weight. Capiche? Here you said, this is our director. Papillion Connor said. Uh, I'm curious. Good to meet you. Uh, uh, he's stiff as stiff. He dragged this guy out of the river, boys. That's what they say is true. People that are in the television business do seem to be pretty shallow. This guy's irritating, but I better play along so he has his keys. Excuse me. But I better play along so he doesn't get suspicious. There are problem, Kiryu? If you can't return a simple greeting, your history in this biz, lad. Figures. A proper greeting is important in every walk of life. What should I do? Observe etiquette. No screwing around. I need to follow etiquette here. Hey. Director Papillion Kaurasan, I am deeply honored to make your acquaintance, sir. Whoa! I just about lost my lunch, Kiyo said. Oh god. Uh, holy wow. I'm counting you today, Kiyo said. Kiyo, I did the green that came naturally to me, but it went over okay, I think. Alright, we, we gotta. We gotta. We gotta. Hit the limelight, okay? Boy. So, anyway, where's that babbling bit of window dressing? She's on deck for our dining report. No dressing? Is that TV jargon? Yes, about that. Our reporter. Okay. Uh -huh. Why the fuck are we here? It was your job to lock down the talent. You did that, didn't you? Sorry, I forgot to get her the scheduled time. She's on her way right now. You incompetent imbecile. If we go over on, on time, we'll be screwing over the restaurant. You're a nice guy, boy, but that shit doesn't cut the mustard. I'm sorry, sorry, this director. What a change from that cheesy goofball a few seconds ago. Guy's got one short fuse. Oh, here she comes. Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm late. No problem, baby. <laughs> I'm sorry, using things like baby doll, sweetheart, shit like that, yucky. <laughs> yucky. We were patient as pie. Ooh la la, don't you look ravishing today. <laughs> oh, Kano said, don't be silly. Okay, gang, let's get this party started. Sin boost plate. What? Even I don't understand that one. No, it's sin boost play. Fuck me, right? Fantastico, to your marks, everyone. Let's roll it. Oi. Mon dieu, what the hell is this? Where's the erasable? Oh, sorry. We'll get we'll get it. <clears throat> sorry, Q Can you grab the erasable from the table there and bring it over? Erasable? 
I can check what's on the table. That's a start. Sure. Hold on. Oh, shit. There's some pretty random things on this table. What do I take? Reasonable must have something to do with the props. I feel like... <clears throat> I feel like that's a trick question, you know? Because if I actually took the eraser, it'd be like, no, an eraser is not an erasable, that's TV jargon. The knife might might make him think, oh, we're... we're but the knife could also be a trick question, because the knife could be like, oh, we're, we're shooting like a, a secret sci-fi horror, whatever the fuck, you know, about a murder in a restaurant. Because I've never technically been told the, the plot of the movie yet. Also, that is... Definitely just a JPEG stretched out over that plate. But what if the definition of erasable is something that... A prop that basically we are... That is... Limited, you know? Like food. I'm taking the food. That's my guess. Hey, I brought the erasable. Thanks, you said so the table if you would. Got it. Is this the the right erasable? <laughs> oh, th that looks tasty, doesn't it? I want you to save for it now. Let link on your <clears throat> I'm so fucking smart. And hey, don't worry about it. But boy Kyu said, I'm so glad you figured out erasable was where I'm so fucking smart! I'm so goddamn smart! I'm a smart boy! I'm a smart boy! I'm so fucking smart! I'm a smart boy! I want a pat on the head and you can rub my belly. What? Huh? It, where the fuck did that one come from? Smart. Moving on. That is the fastest I've ever put you in the chair. <laughs> that was like a frame one chair put. <laughs> All right, get out, of the, get, out of, get out of the chair. You're ruining my moment. Yeah, I figured that food is erased when it's eaten. Brilliant. The shooting's, the shoot's going smoothly thanks to you. I managed to be useful somehow. You've got your own seat. I'll make another or chat change to make you not feel special. Wow, that looks delicious. There's so much, but it looks so tasty. I could eat it all in one sitting. Good. The shoot's going along smoothly. Pardon me, Kyu Chan, but we still have. But we have to still life that erasable layer. Uh, sure. Grocer the erasable? What could that mean? Fetching a grocery clerk might be a bit too far-fetched. Tilting the food at an angle kinda seems like the weird side question that that works out, you know, it'd be like. But gross a grocery clerk sounds a bit too much like. Like, like the right op, like, uh, the most simple option, you know? Because the name of the game is probably, they'll say something that, that sounds like, you know, one of the tasks here, but the, it's not. It's a grosser or something. My guess would be to leave only the produce? Tilt the food at an angle. I'm gonna go with leave only the produce. <clears throat> uh, I got this. Yeah, leave. Oh, <laughs> I ate it. <laughs> That's a great looking grocery job if I say so myself. Hey, I grocered it. Really, QHA, let's take a look. Oh god. Oh god. He's about to blow up on me. Right? This guy? Hi. Good, good. You clear out the meat, leaving just the vegetables as near as you please. Thank you for a job. Yeah. Something wrong? Something wrong? Something wrong? How in the devil's cleft are we supposed to still life this now? What? 
Are you gross or a prop it beats? Okay, uh, okay, but that's what it meant. Now the cook will have to prepare the same dish again. Delete the shoot. Damn. Listen, I make mistakes, okay? Fucking excuse me for not knowing how to grocer something. Dude, it's almost done. Sorry, Q said. Did I get you to jeer these props? It's about time to strike the set. Jeer these props and strike the set, man. Uh, well. Cheer at the strike the set. To strike normally to me means to strike, or I guess in this case would be slash. Like you slash over a word to get rid of it, you know. So my my guess would be remove the dishes. <laughs> Thank you, Q said. I'm so fucking smart. Look, okay. I might have gotten grosser wrong, but... Yeah, right. No, seriously. You're really helping us out. Looks like I got that right. Come on. I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm two and one, okay? Thank you. That's a wrap. Let's blow as popsicle stand. The shoot's over, I guess. Like, come on. I, I might, I might have gone two and one, but that's, that's fine. He said, you saved us. You know, showbiz lingo like a pro. No problem, I had fun with it. That was something else. It's rare to see a producer who can take charge on location like you. Please accept our thanks. A magnetic necklace. Boy. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. The real producer. Producer Lita. Did the shoot go down okay without a real crew? The producer? Uh. What the devil? Why would you even bother showing up? Ah, uh, you need it on a teleprompter? We're here to beat some manners into you. Just for working us like slaves late into the night. Who the hell do you think you are? We got into broadcasting because we love television. But thanks to you, we don't have time to go home and watch TV. That's no way to live. What can I say? It takes blood, sweat, and tears to make a TV show. Fortified gentlemen. Big talk as always, director. Who made you so important that you can treat the producer like this? I've had it with you. That's why we boycotted the shoot today. We're on strike. Boycotted? We're like, let your personal job get in the way of work. You call yourselves professionals? Yap it all you want. This is the last time we'll ever see you. Let's end the shit show on a happy note. For us. Shit. Oh my gosh, what do we do? I got this. Huh? Kiryu huh? said. Hey, hold it. Uh, who the hell are you? The name's Kiryu. I'm the producer here. I can't have people harassing my crew. Kiryu chat, I... Wait, you're my replacement? You just doubled my fun. I'll show you how irreplaceable I truly am. Come on, boys. We'll deal with this faker first. Fucking shatter the hedgehog. Oh, good. They, one of them has a weapon. Take it to kill him first. Oh, damn. I just drop kicked that guy. Come here, buddy. Yeet. <clears throat> All right, champ. Let's go. One-on-one. One-on-one. -on -one. This is your moment. Tell me what's good. Tell me what's good. May our sweater vest collide in an epic fight. Okay, well. Pop. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You'll get me. Stop it. Come on. You'll get me. 
was unfortunate, man. Unfortunate. Oh, and OBS is fucked off, so you didn't get to see me bully that man. Aw, that's really unfortunate. You guys missed me bully that man. Now, now we get to... Yeah, okay, welcome back. That hasn't happened in a while, has it? That's unfortunate, because you missed me just play with my food. How did they... How did, did they pull this guy off of a bodybuilding show? Forget this. And there they go. Q said, are you alright? Uh, yeah. Thanks a million, Q Chad. It's the least an amateur like me can do. So, you were faking it after all, Q Chad. You knew? I'm no fool. I knew something was off the moment we met. You were a fish out of water from hello. Couldn't fool a pro after all. But if you do, why don't you get rid of me right away? Because, Q Chad. You did the best you could with such passion, despite not knowing a damn thing. TV is not a gentle mistress. A single minute or even seconds of footage can take dozens to hundreds of hours of hard work. The struggle is, as we say, real. The challenge demands an incredible level of precision, experience, and skill. But there's something even more important to tho than those. And, and that, mon ami, is it passion. Passion. I believe TV gives view viewers hopes and dreams. Not anymore. There are people out there who could be inspired by TV to change their jobs, even their way of life. No, they cannot. I think TV is a media medium that has the power to change people's lives for the better. No, it will not. You might be right about that. Uh, Most death. That's why I make programs with passion, no matter how hellish the process may feel. As creators, we are the dream weavers. It is our duty to pass those dreams on to others. Quite a director. You know that? <laughs> hey, pish posh. I'm just an overbearing loser who can't even hang on to a solid crew. I want to bring the same passion I have for my workout to them, but I never seem to get through to them. Yeah. Director Kato, what you just said, that moved me to my core. We have a, a lot of growing up to do. I want to do more. I want to make better programs. I want to create shows that bring pe people joy and inspiration. I want to challenge, channel our passion to the art of film. So please, we want you to keep a, us on us like you do. You guys... That's like, like he got through to them, don't you think? They get your old-fashioned sense of passion. Here you, Chad. Thanks, honestly. You truly are a great producer. But you won't stop giving us hopes and dreams, right? Uh. Au contraire, mon frère. We'll, we'll show you dreams you've yet to see even in your mind's eye. Okay, boys, production meeting. Let's drill down a plan for some better shows from the top. <laughs> what? We just wrapped. Have mercy. Ha ha ha. And all of this... What the heck does from the top mean? <laughs> all of this, all of this, just so that we can have 17 different home renovation shows on fucking... What was it, like, TMC or whatever. All of this... Just so that we can have, like, 17 different property brothers. I said this before on Twitter, but I'm going to, uh, like, repeat this joke. If I put every single, like, uh, house home renovation show, I think that we should, like, reinvent the wheel here and just put them on, like, an arena and tell them to fight to the death. I want to see that. I want to see, like, a property brother with, like, a war axe. Damn, I had that man on his knees. Not in a fun way. Is this the location for the fucking board videos again? What is happening? Excuse me? Huh? What did I just want? Uh, uh, no, this is. I don't want this cutscene. Punish me. Huh? Hurry, now. Punish me where, where everyone can see my shame. Oh, some kind of S and M club here, I guess. Bad. How to tr? How to? How to? How to? How to? How to trade? How to? How to? Tra how to? How to? Did they just do a fucking How to Train Your Dragon reference with a dominatrix? 
And what people do in privacy in the privacy of their own home is one thing, but is this really necessary out on the street? Out to um okay then you you middle-aged man. Yes, go on. Um uh you lusty guy. More put your soul into it. Please visit again, you you customer. Oh no, HA, that was no good. Like nothing about it was working, nothing at all. I knew you were bad during the roleplay, but I did expect to be bad at just saying goodbye. Can you please tell me what I did wrong? Where do I start? When I asked you to punish me, you said I was a middle-aged man. That's the truth, not a put-down. I suppose that's true. And then you called me lusty. I mean, who says that? If, I, if I'm coming here, lust is pretty obvious, I'd think. What's the joy of being told what you already know? Also true. And to top it off, please visit again? That's proper business etiquette, not sadomasochism. Oh, oh, okay. We got the fucking abuse entrepreneur over here. The fucking masochism master. Okay, the pegging pariah. Fuck face. So sorry. Oh man, a chan. You're an SM queen, a dominatrix. You should never ever apologize. Are they your terrible humiliation skills? You're the girl of my dreams. But I don't know if I can keep this up. If you disappoint me next time, I'll have to ask for a different girl. See ya. The masochism maestro. That's that's a good one. Sniffle sob. SM must be a tough act. She's crying. Do I console her? Yes, we do. Come on, Kiryu. I'm a real dominatrix now. Hey, are you okay? Oh, uh, sorry. I'm sorry for causing a scene in public, too. It's okay. Well, it was a scene, I guess. But this S&M thing, it sure has some unique challenges, doesn't it? Yeah, very much so. What do you think after watching that? I'm not cut out for this line of work, am I? <laughs> Honestly, you do seem to be car too caring and gentle to play a dominatrix. I find it very hard to berate someone, especially a client. It just feels like I'm being rude. I would think your customers pay you because they want to be abused by you. If you're so hung up about berating someone, why are you even working as a dominatrix? Since I was a child, I could never rebuke anyone. Even when my friends betrayed me, I laughed it off and forgave them. I'm still like that today. But those relationships I built on swallowing my feelings were false. They were shallow. I realized I had no real friends, not one person with whom I could share my honest feelings. I took this job to transform myself into someone who could tell people exactly what's on her mind. But now I see that I'm not cut out for it. Well, that's quite a leap of logic to make. But if you're still motivated, why not stick with it? But, but I don't have the talent to be, be a dominatrix. Hey, check it out. Got ourselves a real life dominatrix. Oh dear God, no, not again. Huh. <laughs> Hey, baby, you always dress like that? Oh, I beg of you, please. I'm not reading that. Um, um, I'm sorry. Could you, uh, -huh. eh? what was that? You got something to say? I'm also not reading that. Oh, you call me a coward? All right, all right. I'm going to make this horrible for you. <laughs> what the hell is this? I thought you were supposed to be all royal and shit. Some S&M queen you are. She says you're bad for business. Uh -huh. Eh? Uh -huh. I'll say it for her. Don't no loiter in front of the club. You're bad for business. Uh, stay out of this, you squealing pig. You can't act all tough when you're trotting out of an S&M dungeon. I'm not a customer. Just get lost. You're a nuisance. Snort. Don't order me around, bacon, bo bacon boy. Whittle, ma whittle masochist piggy take... Bob's taking a punch of my white. I know how to make you feel real good, Dad. Yeah, yeah, you enjoying this? You you happy with your choices? You happy with calling me a coward? Now I gotta now I gotta run your shit. Give me this. Yes, very happy. Wait, now hold on a minute. Come here! Man, the enemies are getting a lot more health. My god, I could just do that and kill him immediately. Is that guy sitting on nothing? Which guy? There's many a guy. Oh yeah, I probably still have to beat your ass too. Alright, die. I hope you're proud of yourselves. You made me break out like an ooh voice. 
Oh, damn. This masochist is tough. You're supposed to like getting your ass spanked. Uh? I said I'm not a customer. Do I need to pound that into your skull again? Act. Next time, pick a safe word before you ask for a flogging. If I see you around here again, you're dead meat. Why, well, sorry. Um, excuse me. Sorry, I caused a big scene fighting in front of your uh, club. No, no, that's okay. Thank you for telling those men what I want to say myself. And, um, what is it? Could you teach me how to punish people? Ah, uh, punish people? Yes, the words he said to send those men scurrying. That was amazing. I want to be like you and berate people the way you do. Wait, I don't know. I want to change myself. Please help me. Yep, yep. Sounds fantastic. She's desperate enough to ask for my help. Even though we just met, she must be serious about wanting to change. I'm not sure I can teach her to berate others, but if she thinks I can help. Okay, I'll do what I can to help. Oh, you will? Thank you. My name's Ayu. I'm so glad I met you. I'm curious. But now what? I don't know where to begin. That's true. For now, though, there are too many people here. Maybe we go to the park, please? Uh, okay. Oh, we're just going to the park? Are you going to at least change so you don't look like a Mad Max character? Oh, still looks like a Mad Max character. Okay. Well, we're at the park. Now what? I'd like to try walking through a set. I'm gonna make this a horrible experience for you and me alike. Oh, how does that work? S7 is about play acting, a certain kind of fantasy. It's a form of role playing, but it's not what you'd expect. I think I could gain better insight into s &M if I were to practice with you. I want to act out of play sets with me taking the daughter role and you. God damn it! Fuck me! Why is it? it, it it's. Uh, I'm destined aligned to be a bottom. Fuck you, game. Fuck you. Also, I'm just saying. At any moment, one of my IRL friends can come in here and see one of the worst things they'll ever hear from me. <laughs> they don't normally come in here, which is great. But that also means that there's still a, 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 a like a one in a million chance that one of my IRL friends could just pop in here and be like, "What? The, what is this moron doing? What is this?" I see. Hey, wait a second. Did you say I have to play the customer's part? Yes, Q said. I want you to play the role of a thoroughly masochistic client. You mean a Twitch streamer? Because we love getting fucked in the ass. <laughs> and as we do this, I'd like you to give me advice on what I should be saying as a dominatrix. Your shoes, whack. Your hair, whack. Me, I'm tight as fuck. I get it, but please, I want to change. If I can't do this, I'll end up as a quiet, dull person for the rest of my life. Should we really be doing this at a place children go to? He's like the guilt on thick. I see your point, though. It would do IU good to learn how to berate others with authority. Besides, I told her I would help. Can't back out now. All right, fine. Not doing anything weird, though. Great. Thank you very much. Here you said, can we start with you entering my chamber? I'll try. Right in there. Strut in there, buddy. Oh, that's not a strike. Mistress, may I serve you today? Yes, please do. Yeah, that's not right. Pardon? Not fully into my role either, so I'm so I'm not one to talk, but I you're a dominatrix, right? Yes, I'm supposed to be. Before you can really dominate someone, you need to understand what it means to be a dominatrix. With this sort of thing, the beginning is crucial. Your first words have to lay out the rules. You're the boss. I see. Then how should I respond to the client's greeting? Alright, classic. Who gave you permission to speak, pig? I would say, who gave you permission to speak, pig? I see. You don't even treat them as a person. That does sound like a dominatrix. Yeah, I wouldn't know how a masochist thinks, but it's probably a turn on for them. Okay, can we do this from the top again? Oh god, this is gonna get really bad. This is gonna be my worst day ever. Mistress, may I serve you today? Who gave you permission to speak, pig? Sorry. I know I told you to do this, but what am I doing? So, how are you going to serve me today, huh? Um, please tell me what you'd like me to do. SNN comes in many flavors. I have to get the client to tell me their particular kink. Got it. But I don't really have anything in particular. How about a game of Connect Four? 
Not, nothing gets my bricks quite hard like hitting you with a four across or four diagonal. Get fucked up. <laughs> I guess not. Then, just in general, what do you want women to do to you, Kyu said? Tell me. Do I actually need to answer this? Chat, do you want me to actually answer this one? What do you want done to me? Nothing really comes to mind, so let's just play the masochist here. God. What a horrible day. <laughs> what a horrible day today is. Humiliated might be too broad, but... Okay, how about humiliated? Uh, I want to be humiliated. Ew, is that right, you said? I would have never guessed. Yeah. I, I don't really want that, though. It's just an example. Besides, that's the wrong response for a dominatrix. Alright, actually, well now, hold on. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. I'm no Dominic aficionado. So I'm not Spade Domly today, but I don't know. Maybe you could throw it and feel like, ew, you're disgusting. You're so gross and vile. Blech. I like you that kick makes them vulnerable. You didn't come back with the right response to maintain trust. See, then how should I respond? Yeah, like that. Like that. Like that! Go with, I bet you'd like that, you pervert. That will do. Oh, that sounds very much like what a dominatrix would say. That's perfect. I'm learning so much from you already. Is this like the porn addict mission? What is this? Yeah, even in casual conversation, you should be working in S&M flavor. Okay, can we try this again? Oh dear God, I have to read this whole, don't I? <laughs> Here it comes. Get ready to cringe. Mistress, I would like you to make me do humiliating things today. I bet you'd like that, you pervert. I... I'm sorry. What am I doing with my life? Yeah, I'm asking that too! Very well, we shall begin. I... Oh... Oh, children! Run! 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 <laughs> Smoke bomb! Hi, what are you guys doing? Oh! Wow, miss, your clothes are so pretty. Are you having fun? Can we pl... No, 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 Guys, this isn't, we're not playing. You see, uh, wait, not you. Calm down. How do you possibly expect me to stay calm down? If we're in a situation right where I need this woman to dob the children, I blowed my brains out on stream. That's a joke. But Jesus! So, oh, think about it. Would a little tr a true dog. Brother, that is borderline child pornography. Listen, hear you. I I'm, I'm gonna keep it a hundred with you, Chief. Most of the stuff you said up to this point, you know, I can vibe with this. Mm -mm, not vibing with that one. Oh, I see. That does make sense. Well, then. What do you propose I say? Answer me. Good. I use back the control. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> they're watching you get humiliated. You should goad him with they're watching you get humiliated. Oh, I see. Being seen could be a big thrill for masochists. Pointing that would make it even more thrilling and... ...titillating for them, right? Good. Now you're getting it. No, I don't want to get anything anymore! I will pepper spray the children to make them leave! I understand now. Can we pick up where we left off? No, we should not! The children are still there! Oh, what, what are you talking about? Do I have to read this? Do I have to fucking read this now? Would you? Okay. You know what? I, I, five bucks. Five bucks on the table. Five bucks on the table. And I will go into the most in-depth, most disturbing fucking detail. I'll never ask for money. This is not even serious. But if you, but if you want to give me money, you could definitely give me money. But not too much money, because then I'd feel bad. Or, or you could just say, do it, and I'd probably still do it. Do not actually give me money. 
I just wouldn't have as much, uh, as much grit into it, you know? I cringe saying that. This might be one of the worst moments of my life. I think, like, this is within top 10 worst moments of my life. Thoughts, opinions? Anybody? All right. Cracking my neck. Cracking my knuckles. All right. I I'm about to, uh, do, do not actually give me money. Seriously, do not actually give me money. Do not actually give me money. Uh, I'll do- I'll do it. I'll do the serious thing. This will be the worst moment in my channel's history. But I'll do it, okay? Mistress. Come on, admit it. You like this, don't you? Watch you be humiliated. Ooh, this is actually pretty humiliating. I don't get this game you're playing. Grown-ups are weird. Let's go. Thank God the children split. I'm so sorry. It was just training, but it caused you embarrassment in the process. Uh. I think I lost some dignity among other things, but it's worth it if it helps you change how you. Thank you. Can you say, can you come with me? I don't like this. Sure. I don't like this. This still works, right? Yes, okay, cool. You lost five bucks? I think I left my bag somewhere around here. I should have something that would make a good token of my appreciation. Bring your personal belongings into the playroom? Hi, Chad. You've got a client. You're requesting you personally. I'll send them through, so get ready, okay? Huh? Uh, yes. Whoa. If you got clients coming in, I shouldn't be here. No, you're right, but <clears throat> this could actually be a great opportunity. So wait, wait, wait. Did you actually donate to me? Now, hold on a minute. Did you- you didn't actually give me money, right? No? Okay, good. Because I was about to, like, open up, like, my PayPal or some shit and, like, try to refund you. I'm going to put what I learned from you into practice, Q said. So, you could- could you hide somewhere and watch for how- Dear uh, God. I never imagined I'd get erupted to watching over an s and session. But alright, I'll do it. Give it your best. I will. Alright, here's- here's my for- I actually just felt like bile rise up in my in my throat there. Like genuine vomit. Here's my guess, all right? You ready for this one? There's two, there's three options I can see going down through here. Why don't we just watch it normally and it's awful? Two, it gets way too crazy and we have to beat the shit out of the masochist. Or three, it gets way too crazy and we beat the shit out of the masochist and this man's like, oh yeah. Are you Chad? I'm back. That's the guy who told I if she was a bad dominatrix. Are you Chad? I want to see how much you've grown as a dominatrix since our last time. Oh my God! Now, mistress, may we begin? Go on, are you? Show him what you've learned. Who gave you permission to speak? How dare you utter human words, you pig? Such insolence. <laughs> Please forgive me. Oh, my God, mistress. If... I'm gonna vomit. I am. I'm gonna vomit all over my all over my controller and just touch the squishy bile on my controller through the rest of the stream. Please forgive me. Oink, mistress. You're fantastically gorgeous today. I can't now. I can't now. I'm breaking down. I'm about to start short circuiting. <laughs> Please, Oink, abuse me some more. <laughs> I don't understand your Oink, you pig in human clothing. Why would I deign to listen to the bleeding of animals? So unreasonable, oink, more, more. I used to take it to a whole new level. The client seems happy too. 
If you did it, so, what should I subject you to today? Please, mistress. I beg you to... Oh, God. Then will I like you... I don't want to read that. I don't want to... Fuck me. Please, mistress. I beg you to whip me. Then will I lie humiliatingly, humiliatingly exposed? Step on me with your pin heels. <laughs> I bet you'd like that, you pervert. Yes, mistress, I am a pervert. You must be. Only a pervert would beg for humiliation from a girl your daughter's age. What a pervert. Pathetic. <laughs> Oh, I can't take it. I'm about to sport my guards. Excellent. Just like I taught her. He's eating it up too. That's that's how it's done. I'm getting really uncomfortable back here. I need to move a little. Huh? You hear that? Damn it. You heard me. Is is someone there? Here you, you broad fuck. Someone there? I busted now. No, he's busted walk out uh you don't work here do you hiya chen who is this guy hi you how will you get out of this one he's your audience my audience i decided to have someone watch you be humiliated don't you find it kinky oh uh, like it don't you you take your flabby bodies on display for everyone or at least this man to see <laughs> Please degrade me, a total stranger is watching me in my mortal shame. Oh, she applied what I told her. Good going, I am. You've got a real knack for this. And he's gonna get a real smack for this. <laughs> this was the worst experience of my life. This was the worst experience of my fucking life. Thanks for the play session, Ayu Chad. Ayu Chad, no, your majesty could. Turned over. <laughs> that guy in the jacket returned, like started walking down the street, and then hears, "No, Your Majesty Queen Ayusala," and did a full 180. <laughs> he's fucked up. He's like, "No, <laughs> I'm getting the fuck out of here. See ya." Ayu Chet, no, Your Majesty Queen Ayusala. Your demeanor was truly regal, and your behavior the height of haughty scornfulness. You were utterly magnificent. Oh, really? You have grown immeasurably since our last meeting, mistress. I feel truly humbled in your presence. Please, allow me the honor of loyally re requesting you. Hmm. How dare you even consider Strang? I'll allow you to keep requesting me, you pathetic swine. Squeal! The bile from my throat is now burning. I, <laughs> you nailed it. Thank you. It's all thanks to your advice, Kiyu said. I just hope I never have to do anything that awkward again. Well, here's a little something to make it all better. Please accept it. What did you just fucking give me? What the what the fuck was that? Thanks to you, Kiyu said, I was able to change it all. I think I've gained enough confidence to make it as a dominatrix now. Good for you, are you? Thank you, Q said. I demand you visit again as a client next time. I shall will bless you with her. Way. I don't see myself coming back for whipping, but I, I'm glad I can help all the same. What a horrible, horrible stream. <laughs> what a horrible, terrible stream. Let me go in. Let me go inside. Let me let me see her again. Let me fucking bleed myself to death in the middle of the room. Ah, oh, shit. Is all that's left for me? It's just the fucking porn parody room. You know what? After, after a day like today, uh, uh, oh, I could either wear... Huh? I think we could use a little bit of karaoke. Feel better about ourselves, you know? You know, it's, it's, we just have to feel better about ourselves.
Let's just, let's just sing Bakamita. Classic. Classic good song. <clears throat> I'll see if I can even get, like, better at this one. Last time we got, like, an 84. I sing for you. We did do better. We missed like four notes. I want this guy at Smash Bros. Just throwing that out there. I do too. I'm a karaoke king. Now that I've been degraded and watched a man sport his guard, and we sank, I think it's finally time we progress the story. I'm going to vomit. I've said that multiple times, but it always is true. Howdy, fellas. Let's get this over with. Come on, champ. Damn, I hit that man so hard I unpacked from the fucking wall. Wait, right, did you guys hear about uh, the new uh, Pokemon Legends game is coming? There's gonna be another one. And I liked the first Pokemon Legends a lot, so I'm, I'm actually pretty excited. And they finally did Pokemon Z. I mean, tech well, actually, it's something like Pokemon Z A or Pokemon A Z. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever you want to say. Whatever you want to say, shit nips. Excuse me. Real life dominatrix coming through. I should probably save my game. Because we've got we've got a good amount of stuff here. Mainly getting degraded. Yeah. Gotta love Tachi about a real estate. I was expecting a sweet little gear ad bonus. This calls for a toast, fellas. Yeah. We deserve to forget all the bad crap for one day. Let's live it up. Looks like these are the homeless guys Tachi Bana employed. Let's say, you know what? I don't really feel like wearing this dish. Wait. Oh god, it's just straight up better. This this thing is just straight up better than anything else that I was wearing up until this point. This shirt is worse than this fucking belt. Hey, dude. Oh, 
Ah, this is the point where I get extorted for booze. <clears throat> How about this? Talk first, booze later. ダメ、ダメ。立花不動産と仕事をしたことがあるってやつは。はい、オーバー。なるほど。飲ませ<笑> So you want beer, just a beer. Beer, sake. You know, shochu. Whiskey? Or scotch. Scotch works too. Hello. Oh god damn it, I found another fucking porn video! Why is this under a bench at a park? Champagne. Yeah, champagne? Yucky. Or as I like to call it, champagne, just to piss people off. Alright, let's go buy these guys their booze. Dame, dame. Howdy. This is a sweet potato thing. I can become friends with the store clerk. I just started working here, so it's, it's, it takes a while to get used to and learn about all the different procs. Well, good luck. Thank you so much. Uh, yeah, look the way up. I'm sorry. Uh, don't worry about it. It's fine. My name is Miho. If you come here often, we'll be seeing each other a lot. So I thought I should, I should, I should introduce myself. Nice to meet you, Miho. I'm um, here you. Okay. I can make another friend. <clears throat> I would love to make more friends. I, 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 my only real friend currently is the weird lady at the bowling alley who's got a fetish. Like some pocket tissues, thanks. I don't even know what the pocket tissues do. You guys sell liquor? Oh, no you do not. Uh, this store over here. Maybe they sort sell the right stuff. I, this is not the right... What? Uh... See? Americana fanboy? Whoa, 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 oh my gosh! Wait, you're kidding, right? Come on, tell me you're kidding. Come on, just tell me. What are they talking about? Oh my god, oh my god. It's like you and I watch news from different planets, I swear. Okay, I'll take pity on you. Prepare to be enlightened. The pop star prince is coming here to Camarocho. Okay, no way. You mean, who? Miracle John, is that is that a place on Michael Jackson? No, no, it's unbelievable, yeah, 100% true. He's coming to Camarocho to shoot a new music video. Whoa, Miracle what now? Get this, he's supposedly in Japan already. Word on the street is that there's some kind of problem though. Doesn't, doesn't matter, I'll get Miracle's autograph no matter what. I wanna see him too. I hope they'll solve the problem so they can start filming soon. 
That's why I've been hanging out here and keeping my eyes open. So some of the production staff could already be nearby. Because the global star named Miracle is here. This cruise finds us some kind of problem. Whatever. Yes, indeed, Kiryu. Whatever. None of our business. I don't care enough. Hello, do you guys sell, uh, beer? Liquor? Anything? No? Okay. Alright. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. I mean, the least I could do right now is deliver that, uh, that sweet potato soshu to the one of the dudes. So that's just one last person I have to deal with in the near future. It was this guy in the back. Alright, there's one. Now let's go out on a mission to go and buy a bunch of beer. The mission is a go. We gotta roll. What? No, 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 no. I, 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 don't, I don't want any of that. I think my favorite part about this game is that it has that one thing that... What the hell is that? It has the one thing that I love more than anything about some video games where, like, I just kind of walk along and adventure kind of just fights its way to me, you know? I love when that happens. Hey. The Joker, baby. It's me. Bob, you so... What? Huh? I'm a master ball! What? Uh huh? Well, now hold on. I don't know what I just fucking bought. Now stone! I have a gun! Judgment outfit? Use the phone in your hideout. This guy just has like a bunch of stuff for me, huh? Actually, somehow never knew that I could exchange this stuff. I would like more money from my enemies. Uh, I guess I'll do that. Do that. I, I I've never really used the dash before, so. How do I even dash? I don't know. I don't really understand what's going on. All I know now is that my inventory is goddamn full with a bunch of useless shit.
Where do I sell this stuff? That's my next question. I have to grab the phone and look it up. Apparently, it's at the a pawn shop. That's where I have to go. Um, not really seeing it on the map. All right, I have to look up where this place is. Can you show me on the map? Apparently it's in a... Bunch of different places, but I'm yet to see one. Like, really, really haven't seen one. Apparently they also sell weapons. Like, like, weapon weapons. Okay. Right around the corner of the... I don't know where that is. Intersection, go to that intersection as you walk a bit, you'll find... I don't know where this place is. I've gone to the fucking... Okay, so according to the map... It, there should be one there, right down there. I'm actually close by to that. That's lucky. Excuse me. I have an ungodly amount of shit that I have to get rid of now. Uh... Well, uh, dear God, that's worth a lot. And I threw out one of the diamond plates, so I don't know what that probably means, but that's not good. Oh, no, the, the diamond... Oh my God. Oh my God, I'm rich. I'm rich. As of now, I'm rich because... Fuck it. Also... Uh... I... I have a bunch of extra stuff. I don't know what this does now. I feel like a part of me doesn't want to use this extra stuff because I... Let's test it out in a fight. Let's see how well it works out. And if it, it like knocks out a dude in like one shot, uh, I'm gonna take it off. Cause I feel like that's kind of just an unfair advantage right off the bat. Hello, what's going on here? 
Let's just lied for it. Could be something serious. I should have. I could have. Hello. Why you would lie? Found. Tell me. Oi. Uh, you... Oh. Quest for the quantum quill. I guess now we know what's going on. Fantastic. Maybe they sell uh, booze. I don't know. I'm taking a guess. I've been in a store exactly That's like so this before. It's a very weird experience. You guys sell booze? Product placement, product placement, product placement. Get paid. That's one of the things I needed. You just sell some other stuff. Seems like the line cleared out. Yeah. Game over, loser. Hey, you're the kid who just lined up for that game, right? Did you manage to get it? Oh, mister. What ha what's the matter? Something wrong? Yes, my, my brand new video game. That guy stole it. What? Wait, you mean that high school kid who just left? Uh-huh. He just r ran up and yelled at me to hand it over. He took it. My RQ3. I spent all morning waiting in line, too. I saved my allowance for a really really long time to get and now it's gone stealing from a little boy that's really low hey kid what's your name it's it's akio akio got it hang tight akio i'll get your game back huh you will so there's no need to cry mister okay i won't cry anymore good that showed some spy little man i like that leave it to me yay thank you mister High school delinquent ran off towards Pink Street with Akio Ar Akio's Arakure game. Let's get him! I need to kill a man! Uh, <laughs> later, freak. So fair. I've been defeated. No doubt about it. That's the kid who took Wait. Akio's game. Hey, you! You have that our current game, don't you? Nope, you just gotta take it from him. Is this one of those missions where, like, something keeps happening and the goal gets further and further away? But eventually just came to an abrupt end, so leave me alone. No can do. I'll take that back to that our current game you took from Akio. Our Q3? That's the last thing I want to hear about right now. Forget it. I'm gonna grind your ass just for the experience. Alright, buddy. Unfortunately for you, I have a new weapon that I kind of like to try out, so, uh, let's see the damage this does. I mean, it makes fights easier, makes them faster. Uh. Mister. Hmm. Akio, I just got the guy who took your air carry. Oh, yay. Okay, give Akio his air carry back. Look, man, I don't have it. Give it up already. If you don't want another beating, hand it over. Get a job next time you want a video game. I told you, I don't have it. I got robbed by a better thief yeah, than me. What? You were robbed too? Yeah, this jerk from a street gang busted out his dagger of stealing. Oops, <laughs> dagger of stealing. Mm. Gang member? You mean that guy who's just here? Uh. Yeah, lame. I could be able to level up by now, but now my RQ3 is probably going to subdue his knife and a uh. fan. Excuse me? Your RQ3 that Arakuri wasn't yours. Oh, you robbed a little kid, then turn around and cry like a baby when you get mugged? How pathetic is that? If you haven't learned your lesson yet, 
you want another class? Oh, and there it goes. The video game talk is going to be the death of me. Don't worry, Akio. I'll get it back for you, I promise. Yeah, okay. Alright, fantastic. Where did you come from? A raincoat man out of nowhere. Can I help you? Oh, sorry, man. I didn't mean to shove you that hard. Um, what are those, like, card things just nearby? Oh, hello. Instead of fighting one of those gross card things, I found a bunch of hooligans. All right. Runneth up on me conformal, buddy. And there it goes. Okay, good night. Ouch. Okay, so one of those disgusting pervy cards is nearby. Pervy card located. We found it. Gross perv card. Wow. This is the best day ever. Also, I got an ungodly amount of money. I don't know where... Like, it was probably from selling all those plates. Here, take my money. Could be actually really useful for me in like a boss fight or something like that. A hundred. Wow. Expensive. All right, we officially have like no money left. Well, the plus side, I've got another perv card. Yep, here here we go again. Hmm, is it that? <laughs> Later, loser. Damn it. No doubt about it. That's the thug who took Arakari from the kid who stole the game from Akio. Hey, you're the guy who stole Arakari from the kid who stole it from Akio, aren't you? Is this just going to keep getting longer? Eh? Who the hell's Akio? And so what if I did? I saw my chance and I took it. That was Akio yeah. then? No. You robbed the kid who robbed Akio of his Arakari. I don't get it. Forget it. Just give back the Arakari cartridge you stole. RQ3. RQ3! I don't want to hear another word about RQ3. I'm going to stomp you flat, Pops. All right, champ. Let's, let's do this again. I've died. Okay, I think that this, uh... That should not have hit. That should not have hit at all, but okay. Oh shit, looks like I'm the one who got stomped. Mister, man, you run, you run a long way. Also, your arms do not look very... there when you run. Like, they're, they're breaking. I just got the water be pump you stole your RQ3 for that nerdy high school kid. Uh, okay, I don't get it, but that's great. All right, give Akio his RQ3. Sorry, pal, but your game got pinched. I'm not playing around. Give the kid his game or you can suffer some more. I'm serious. It's really gone. Some a-hole got the jump on me. What? You were robbed too? Uh, yeah. This is this hard-ass Yakuza type held me at gunpoint, forced me to give it to him, then took off. Yakuza type? You mean the guy who's just here? My god! We're just going up the ladder, huh? Uh-huh. What a shitty day I'm having. That Yakuza guy jacked my RQ3. He's probably not even a fan. Your RQ3? That game wasn't yours to begin with. Brah. You see from a kid that cry like a little baby when you get mugged? I'm seeing a pathetic pattern here. If it isn't getting through to you, how about we go for go another round? And there he goes. He scatters off. Yeah, don't worry, I'll go and I'll go and plunder every single person who's who's done this, I guess. Keep going. Keep going up the ladder.
What are those subtitles? Excuse me. Hello. Up here. Oh, what, what, what were with the subtitles? <laughs> Sorry. Excuse me. I'm busy. That looks like him. <laughs> Quest is complete. Boy. Hey, that game you got there. Ooh. What's that, fool? You're one of the losers who couldn't score an RQ3. That's some tough luck. For you see, this RQ3 belongs to us. So if you want to live, get off my street and listen. Don't bother looking for a place that's still sell selling RQ3. Just find a fool who bought it, bought one, and take it. Villains, every last one. What's this world coming to? Wow, oh. what'd you say, boy? That RQ3, I'm taking it back. What's that? Take it back? Don't act like it was your game to start with. Uh. Shut up. It's complicated. Oh, I see. You're an RQ3 hunter, too, then. Playtime is over. I'm not holding back. He's got a gun! I've never fought a dude with a gun, so here's the plan. Just keep mashing the X button until things go my way. No, this cannot be. I'll be taking the RQ3 with me. Hold on, please. I need that. Give it back. Come on. Give it back. This was never yours to begin with. Oh, I'm begging you. My little boy's been really looking forward to playing it. Son, uh, yeah. The old lady left me and took the boy with her. He's been wanting an RQ3 ever since he read about it. Went looking everywhere, but there ain't none for sale anywhere. I just want my boy to be happy. Fella, I'm begging you. I beg it here. You gotta let me have it, please. I get the picture. I'm sorry, but I can't do that. You probably don't know this, but a little kid saved up his allowance and went through a lot of trouble to buy the last copy of this arc. Uh, so much dialogue, eh? I didn't stick up no little kid. I took it off some worthless goon. Uh. That's right. You got the game from a punk, but that game belonged to a little kid first. Long story short, you took RQ3 from a wannabe punk, you took it from a high school bully, who took it from the last boy in line, who bought it in the first place. Mm. It hurts just thinking about it, but alright, so that's what happened. I came to get it back for the little kid. It's going back to the rightful owner. I'm sorry. Bella, I'm the fool here. Give it back to that kid for me. Damn, I was about to make some, someone else's kid cry for the sake of my own. What kind of monster have I become? I thought I could make my boy happy with something I stole from someone else. I was wrong. How am I supposed to be a good dad to my boy? Bad, there's the twist. I guess you better think about that. Wait, what? Oh, hi, mister. <laughs> Perfect timing. RQ, I just got your RQ3 back. Oh, really? Yep. <laughs> uh, RQ, it's you. My RQ. Oh, hi, Papa. Daddy. Papa? You guys are related? <laughs> That's right. Are you friends with Papa, mister? Mm. Uh, yeah, you might say that. Sure. Mm. Wait, funny. That little kid you were telling me about, that RQ3 there was what RQ bought with his own money, and I tried to... I'm about to sneeze. It's in my nose. That seems to be how this is shaking out. But why, Akio? Why didn't you say anything to your papa? All you had to do was ask. I could have given you the money to buy RQ3 at any time. Because mama gets mad at you, papa. For spending money on golfing and go-karts and board games and... I didn't want mama to get mad at you even more for spending all your money again, papa. So I tried to buy it myself. Akio... Mr. Papa looks kind of scary, but he's really, really a nice man once you get to know him. He took me to a bunch of game stores just the other day. Papa's not living with Mala and me now, so I think he's lonely. So please stay friends with him, okay? Actually, Akio, your Papa helped me get your RQ3 back. Really? Thank you, Papa. I did, in a way. Akio, I don't want you to see... I don't want to see you crying again. Be careful going home with your game. Yep. Got it. Thank you, mister. Mister. Thanks. This is to, to apologize. I to thank you for teaching this fool lesson, baby. Whatever. I want you to have it. A sunburst. Oh, damn. That's a sword. From now on, be a good dad all the time. 
That's just in front of Akia. You don't want to do anything that'll make kids sad, no matter whose kids they are. Yep, you got that right. Papa, this is too hard for me by myself. Let's go to Mama's house and play RQ3 together. I need help with the mats. Uh, sure. My expert advice really making a beeline to that nasty demon lord in no time. And that's how a game should be played. How, how sweet. How cute. How pleasant. That was lovely. Made me smile. Made me happy. Alright. How good is this sword? This sword's a little bit worse than my current weapon. However, on the plus side, I did not get the sword from a random clown dude. So, I'll use the sword. Curve card nearby. Where's the perf card? Perf card, I see it. I see it. Perf card. Wow. This is the worst collection I've ever started. Am I about to end up in another situation? Oh, it's you again. Oh, oh. Hey, Chad. Ciao. Huh? Hey, it's been a while. Not really, it's been like an hour. Are you still making sure that brings hopes and dreams to people's lives? <laughs> oh, ho. Oh. Yeah, easy for you to say, big Mr. Producer. <laughs> Listen, I've got a chance here to drive viewers bananas. Not just in Japan, but all over the world. Okay, how do you figure? You're a real producer after all, Kyo Chan. The chance to whip the whole world into a frenzy got your attention? You know I'm just an amateur. But okay, I'm willing to listen to your fairy tale. It's going to drive the world crazy. Crazy thing is, it's no fairy tale at all. What? Is that enough of a hint for you? No. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. What was that all about? Here, Chad, don't tell me you don't know who Miracle... Oh, God, it's Miracle Johnson. We're back. I like it now. I just heard about him. He's some kind of singer, right? Seriously? Here, you baby. Are you telling me you haven't heard of the pop star prince until today? He's world famous. Famous to the world, maybe, but this is Kamurocho, Japan. Why should that matter? Kamurocho is part of the... Fine, fine. It's not important. Say la vie. Basically, Miracle is in Japan to shoot his new music for you, but... And this is strictly hush hush, there's been a little problemo holding up the El Shuto. You catch my drift? Yeah, you're saying there's a problem. Uh. Yes. And I'm convinced there's only one man capable of solving that problem. That's you, Kiryu Chad. Why me? I've been looking for you everywhere. Why me? I can't go into details because it's a top secret mission. But will you help me? Let's set the world ablaze, you and me. Okay. Fine, let's hear it. Now you're talking. That's what makes you an ace producer. So, what's the problem? It's the superstar himself, actually. Miracles refuse to perform until his demands are met. Whereas, stand still. What is, what, is the guy being a diva? Not really, no. He's just really insistent on doing the music video exactly right, and he won't compromise. What's this music video about? To be honest, I don't really get it. A fairly involved miracle. Yep, yep, that is exactly Michael Jackson. Zombies? Yes, but if they were to really attack, he could get hurt, so we told the extras to take it easy when they swarm him. The miracle got wind of that and blew his stack. He says the zombies have to attack like they mean it. Otherwise, the action wouldn't feel real. So he's refusing to do it. There's a lot I don't get here. Like, how can a zombie video feel real to begin with? Uh, who knows? They're Westerners, man. They're so crazy. This is gonna be a surefire hit if it happens. Well, I understand the problem now. What I don't get is how I fit into the picture. You're the man to keep Miracle safe from the zombies, baby. You want me to protect him? Yeah, for the sake of realism, the zombies are gonna go all out to attack Miracle. Try to eat him and everything. But we, we don't, we can't let the pop star prince get hurt. That's where you come in, my old friend. Oh my god, there's so much dialogue! That's like a strange gig, but seems simple enough. Of course, of course. It is, is it just the perfect job for you? Let's go get the deets from the music video's director. Sure. Oh my god, every day, every few minutes, I just end up on a new crazy quest. I feel lightheaded. I finally got the man for the job. Oh, it's you, Poppy. Who? 
Sorry to keep you waiting. Oh, yes. His name's Papillion. Introducing the powerhouse produced with the biggest brains, bronze, and balls of the modern mass media. Here's Kiryu Chan. I'm Kazuma Kiryu. Good to meet you. Oh, so you're the famous Mr. Kiryu. I was told you have an extraordinary cool aura. I see it's true. Who the fuck? <laughs> ah! Is that supposed to be Steven Spielberg? I'm Mr. Spining. Oh, is it is it like Steven Spielberg plus The Shining? Did Steven Spiel, Spielberg wrote The Shining, right? Oh god, why can't I remember? Welcome to our team, Mr. Kiryu. Thanks. Oh, Mr. Kiryu, I should also introduce you to my Paul Lewis. He's on the team too. <laughs> Howdy, welcome to the family. Good to meet you. So, Kiryu, is this blowing your mind or what? I'm sure you you know already, but just in case, this man here is none other than the director of the massively worldwide smashing movie. Yeah. Mm -hmm. you what? Yeah. You're breaking my balls here, Kiryu. Are you a hermit? How do you not know this man's films? Sorry. <sighs> Mr. Q, perhaps you're more of a sci-fi guy? Oh, right. Kiryu, even you have to know this one. <laughs> Shut up! Uh, sure. I guess I might have heard about it. Yeah, see? I knew even you had to know. Mr. Spining is an amazing director. Right, Kiryu-chan? So right? Uh, yeah, amazing. Uh, it's no big deal, honestly. So it, it was number one at the box office worldwide. Sure was. So, Mr. Spining, with you at the hell of this music video, are we anticipating another worldwide so hit? Nick. Absolutely. The fans are all over the roller wing for this one. I don't think... Has Spielberg ever directed a music video before? I don't like the way his mouth moves. It kind of moves like a weird Pez dispenser. I don't want to waste any, any more time, but I need to confirm one thing before I describe your mission. Is that okay? Uh, sure. We're here to film Miracle Jonathan's latest music video. Do you understand what that means? This whole world's going to be watching? Clever boy, but that's only half of it. The full answer is that this has to be the most exciting music video ever made. Failure to achieve that is unacceptable. No fails here. Okay. Wow, that's heavy. You have to head to Hollywood. They work on a scale we can only dream of. Don't you agree, Kiyu Chan? Uh, Not really, no. Uh, yeah, it's huge. Good. I'm glad you get the picture. Hey, guys, Mr. Johnson is ready to enter the room. Oh, good. Sounds like Miracle Johnson is about to join us. Let me introduce you to him. Hey, come on in, Miracle. H how Michael Jackson... Gonna... Oh my god. Hey. Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh! Woohoo! Oh, Miracle, look at Raz, haven't you know it's spiding? I was born cool. Born to hey. do it, yeah. Doo doo feces, as Michael would say. Hey, man. You, you my partner? No. Yeah. Here, Chad, what are you saying? Of course you're partners. Oh, that's right. Miracle, that's Mr. Q, your partner today. He's a little shy. Okay, okay, no problem. I, he I heard about Japanese people being shy, so that's human nature. It's all good. I'm Kiryu, glad to meet you. And I'm Miracle Johnson, nice to meet you. I can see the polygons on those glasses. Uh, yeah, likewise. Hey, man, have they told you about the mission, Mr. Kiryu? A little, but I don't get it. I could use some more info. Okay, since you're all here, I'll explain what's happening. The setting is here, Kamarocho. One of ancient no, one of the world's premier entertainment districts. A zombie horde suddenly emerged and attacked Miracle on the street. Miracle evades the attacking swarm and dances its way through the land of the rising sun. The very picture of cool, it's Tableau. Tableau? Tableau? Truly befitting our pop star prince. It's gonna be funky. Yeah. Whoa. Hey, so why zombies? I still don't get what's going on. Apparently they're really into that sort of thing overseas. I mean, the big Hollywood director is behind it. It's gotta be a new trend. I I don't know about that one. I 
think this city is fabulous. It always glitters and shines. I love it here. Kabarocho is like an amusement park. Yeah, and once the stage is set for a close encounter of the undead kind, Miracle will spin and weave his magic dance. Mr. Kira, this is where you come in. Your job is to escort Miracle Protector from the Walking Dead. Walking Dead? DMC? I mean, the actors playing the zombie. I told the actors to play the zombies to attack me like they mean it. If the danger is not real, the thrill is it either. I tried to stop him, but if the pop star prints were injured on the set, the whole world would be screaming for my head on a stake. That'd be really bad. Who's bad? Shut up! Oh my butt! Oh 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 oh! I'm getting mad. I'm getting upset. No, Spider. I told you how serious I am about this. Compromise my artistry would be a betrayal to all my loyal fans. A miracle. You're the ultimate entertainer. Yeah. Oh, stop fighting. Don't, please don't pose. God damn it. That's nothing. The, the whole world doesn't already know. Uh, I'm really so sorry about this cute chat. I feel responsible. He's like a Jojo character. No, it's all right. I know it's not your fault. So there you have it. Surely you understand now. Well, part of that was understandable. Whatever, let's just start filming. Yeah, Kiyo, I like that fire. You're gonna rock my world with passion like that. That's enough. That's the spirit, Kiyo. Hold on to that anchor. Let's roll him. We're going in. Whoa. I feel like my brain is liquefied. Like inside my skull, it's just gonna start leaking out my eardrums. Miracle, I cure you. Let me explain what you two have to do. Miracle, when you unveil your miracle walk dance, shimmy and shake your way from here to the end of the street. I know you know this, but please try to keep it elegant. Okay. No problem. This dance is going to bedazzle the so world. Mr. Cure, your job is to protect Miracle from the zombies by whatever means necessary. Uh. Yeah, got it. Haha, <laughs> good cure. You're the man. Is <laughs> it fucking... Jojo character. He has to pose every second. Can we get along with this? Okay. Alright. So, basically, it's just one of those, like, escort missions. They immediately went directly past me. That man is dead. I think I might have to throw out a different style for this. I hear that come. Thankfully, this style is a lot more depth than, uh...
Whoa. Yeah, this style's a lot more depth at just hitting hard. And that's kind of what I have to do with this situation. It's going down. It's going down. Get up. We're almost there. We're so close. Well, not really. I'd say there's about two or three more waves of zombies. We, we made it. All right, cool. That was close. Oh. Excellent. Amazing. Magnificent. <laughs> that was stupendous miracle. I can tell you, I can tell you right now that that was that I just shot the greatest music video of all time. This will be the stuff of legends. Spiding, please. I only did what I was expecting me. The real honor goes to Kiryu. He was cooler than ice. Shut up. Please. You're so right, Kiryu. If it weren't for you, this masterpiece would have never happened. For the bottom of my heart, I thank you. I think I bludgeoned most of the crew to death, dude. Hey, man. Thank you. How would you like to be my personal bodyguard? You'd be like another part of me, man. <laughs> Kiryu, baby, this is it, man. The golden ticket. A pop star prince is recruiting you. <laughs> Maybe saying a superstar might be a decent life. The world is too big a stage for me. Kamurocho is plenty big. Uh, how disappointing. But I guess I can't deprive Kamurocho of its star. That's the way you make me feel, Kiryu. Hey, Chad. Very well. I'll leave you with a gift, then. Hey, zombies, come on. Is he about to fucking dance? Is he about to dance? Well, in theory, it could be a trick. It could be something that's saying that the smaller box has an infinitely more useful item. Is that 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 could just be the way it works, you know? I'm gonna go with the smaller box because that's normally how this game tries to pull. Okay. My gift to you. This. What is this? A, a baseball shirt. Uh, Thank you. A, a baseball shirt? You got me a baseball shirt. That was what you got me. Why are you dancing too? Hey, hey. Uh, I still don't really get your American groove, but it was a thrilling experience all the same. At least I'm have to fight zombies again. Just you wait. And if I'm ever back in Japan, I'm gonna look you up, Kiryu. You wouldn't mind, uh, would you? I'll think about it. Hey, Miracle, we better get going. The world needs to see what we've got waiting for them. Looks like my time is up. Everybody's dancing! I'll see you around, Q. I got a feeling this isn't the last time. Uh. Sure, I look forward to it. You know what that reminds me of? There's this really, like, I don't know if this reference is gonna make sense. Old, like, Go Anime videos had, like, four, like, different animations. 
and they always use the dance one for some reason. Like, even if it wasn't fitting in any sense of the word, it was just always there. It was horrible. A horrible, horrible video every time, but that's what it reminded me of. And this thing is just worse. It's just straight up. Uh, I would say the MMD stuff, I, I was thinking more Go Animate. You know? The MMD stuff is normally, like, tied to, like, an actual dance or, like, an actual song, to my memory. Save the game real quick. There we go. All right, we, we still have to go and get these guys their booze. I kind of forgot about that. Someone in here wanted champagne. I think it was, uh, you back here. You were the dude who wanted champagne. Yep. All right, so if my memory is correct, you wanted beer. You wanted something. I don't entirely remember your thing. And you wanted uh, scotch. I'm sure that whatever he wanted will come to me in a minute. Oh. Uh-oh. Now, hold on, fellas. <clears throat> Let me switch to the right fighting style. All right, let's go. Why is that traffic code so big? What is this huge traffic code doing? It's gone now. Did I miss it dearly? Come here, you. And they were no more. All right, we might have to travel around a little bit to find the right the right stuff. That's fine. That's a-okay. I'm patient. As long as I don't end up in another situation where I have to help shoot a music video or record a scene in a film or teach a woman how to be a dominatrix. Because that all happened in the span of two hours. Two hours. And, yeah, 30 minutes. I'm glad I picked up that extra money thing from, uh, my, uh, my point, the, the shrine. That's what it was. That means I can upgrade faster. And that means I get stronger faster. Which makes me happy. Uh oh. What are with these dudes? Is this how it actually is? You just walk around the street and all of a sudden a group of fucking bootleg Will Smith characters come and jump you? Is that the way this works? All right, now I'm going shopping. Leave me alone. Yes, All right. Oh yeah, that dude wants sake. I forgot. Yes, He wants sake. I still don't really know what the pocket tissues do. But it's there. Alright, so we, we got the sake. Now we just need the, the beer. Uh... The, the scotch 
and that should be it. Oh, not again. Right, that's two. That's three. And there we go. What did I? I counted to. Th I had the, the nearly four, but there were only three guys. I don't know what was wrong with me there. Perf card nearby. Perf card. Wow. I think the door might be over here. Oh. Where's the, where's the door? Here? Huh? Not there. Could it be like really weird? It'd be like... Huh? No, that's, that's the location of the shrine. I'm not here for the shrine. You, wait, I can actually, like, search the names on them? Like, I, 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 I went to the place and I, 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 I put one in. That was yeah, deeply you. disturbing to do on a stream, but... Oh, wow. Okay. Thanks, game. Why, why though? Why, though? Like, I, I mean, I'm not judging. It's just more of a case of, like... I don't know, just, it, it mat just spare a thought for a developer, you know, you're working late hours. You're working late hours. You know, we've gotta, we've gotta get these porn actresses in the game for our little mini game before sundown, guys. We gotta go, we gotta get to work. Sorry. I don't know. I just, I, I, I it's interesting in like the weirdest way possible. Do you guys sell whiskey? All right, well, there's some scotch. And so now all I have to do is find a beer. Like literally one. One beer, and then we've got all the liquor for all the old dudes, and then I can cough up all the information I need. I mean, you know what? I'm not really going to brag on it too much, because you are right, it does fit the setting. And who would I be if I were to rag on a game for fitting the setting like that that's i don't know that's, that's not right they did a good job at fitting the setting no this is the pawn shop is it a this is a convenience store i don't i don't need to go to the pawn shop That took a lot longer to load than normal. Uh, I, you know, we're in the area, so let's just go and get some of this stuff out of inventory. Sorry. Alright. You in the back. You were the one who wanted scotch. Didn't I buy sake somewhere? I, I did. I, 
I swear to God, I, but I. Oh, maybe it's not like I have to guess who, uh, who, I have to remember whose order was what. Instead, it's just, it just tells it for me. Okay. You see, I was, I was remembering their orders the whole time just to make sure that I wouldn't be met with like a, okay, now what were our orders, you know, for question. Hope you know it. Are you sure you guys don't sell beer? Don't. Well, I'll buy some of those. Oh, that's fun. All right, let me see here. So... I, mean, I could go to, like, every single convenience store on the map here. I'm patient enough to do that. I have to keep an ear out for perv cards. I feel like what would be around here. Nailed it. What am I doing with my life? <laughs> I'm sorry. It, it's it's six o'clock on a on a. Wednesday? No, Thursday. And I'm out here collecting porn cards to trade, like Magic the Gathering. That's how I'm spending my Thursday. You guys don't... Uh... Uh, it's just, uh... Oh, God. I I'm... Uh, drink your milk. You guys sure you don't have beer? You do not have beer. I don't mind t general tips. General tips are fine. I mean, I know a lot of people get nervous about the whole no backseating thing. Uh, and Backseat is different, you know? General tips are fine. Oh yeah, I, I always forget about the item box. I probably should just throw some of these in here. And I... I, I The thing is that, like, I knew about the item box because I put... That's where I put my stupid little dolls that I collected. Maybe that we should put all of my pocket tissues in there. Like, I probably don't need to carry this many pocket tissues everywhere. Alright. Um, so if I had to guess, is there a... There is a... A, uh, tab up here. Okay. Oh. Alright, come on. Let's do this again. Wait, I can whip out weapons and fights? Time to time to figure it out. Well I I figured out how to taunt. Oh, there it is! It's down on the D-pad. Damn that man went flying. And hey, I also figured out how to taunt people. Because I just never read the controls. I 
fucking idiot. Okay. Hello, this place looks nice and fancy. This is another pawn shop? Eat it is. What do you sell here, sir? Ah. Uh. How lovely. Alright, so... I mean, maybe, uh... This discount store over here could have the beer I need? I don't know. Oh! Hey, guys! Oh yeah, let me deal these delinquents. <laughs> Without a sword. The holy energy of the sun. The unmatched power of the sun, officer. Did my sword just break? Where'd my sword go? Does it have like durability? Hey, I got a silver plate. I don't, I don't get it. You know don't think about it. Don't think about it. <laughs> I think about it too much that my brain's gonna start to hurt. It it has durability. Okay. Wait, I've been here before. This does. It's... All right. So note to self: maybe I shouldn't just try to waste my sword on slashing apart delinquents. Kind of a waste of a good sword. Uh, I don't know if I've been to the... I, I think I have been to that convenience store before. Unfortunately for us here, I'm kind of lost a little bit. I mean, it feels really, it feels like it should be really easy to go and find a beer or something, but it's it's, it's not, for, for, for me at least. Um, and I'm a bit, bit of a silly guy, so... No, th this place didn't have beer, did it? No, it, 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 it was like a pharmacy. A very uncomfortably small pharmacy. Like, a claustrophobically small pharmacy. I mean, there is maybe a chance that I could go and find, like, a beer at, like, one of those session stands, almost. I don't know. I'm taking guesses as I go. I feel like there would be a, uh, another perv card in here. Why are these... You gonna stop these dudes? These dudes were just standing in here being suspicious. All right, bye.
I don't think we've really been too far down this section of the map. Especially in this area. Earth Angel. Hey, perp card. Oh no, wait, we've been here. Yeah, this is where we met, uh, not Michael Jackson. My favorite character. Oh. All right. Let's see it. Word of advice, you better not sit there, buddy. Just see reserve. Nothing like that. Besides, why hide in the corner? Come on over. Let's lift a glass or three. Sure. What? Huh? I'm not sure that's a trick with a stranger like that. You sure can pound it. Looks like you could hold your liquor. Don't say that. <laughs> yeah. Looks like you could hold your own in a fight, too. Am I telling me how you make a living? Hey, you don't have to say if you don't want to. Just, you know, curious. No, it's not that. It's a little complicated, but I had to go straight recently. I had to go straight, eh? So, used to be... Huh. Boss man, the usual. Of course, right away. That's the scene I was just... You seem a little oblivious, so let me break you up to speed. The guy who just came in? Whoa, don't look now. He's a monster. Is that right? Huh? You're not faced in the least. Well, I suppose that makes sense, you being ex-Yakuza and all. From the information I pieced together, he waits there for customers to come in and buy... Come to him and buy weapons. Uh. Weapons? Yeah, guns smuggled in from China. Keep the source and worth a bundle steal selling, not stealing, selling to the Japanese. How do you know all this? <laughs> I'm a journalist. Know the magazine Weekly Sh Shijitsu? Shijutsu? I don't know how to say it, that stuff. I'm very bad at words. I write yeah. for him. No, can't say I do. So you're a journalist. The name's Kas Kasuga. Kas Kasuga? God. I'm curious. Okay. There, it's in the memory bank now. See, I'm investigating the dark side of Kamarocha. This town's teeming with shady characters. I want to get the inside scoop and blow the covers clear off. Dark side of Kamarocha, huh? Mm. I'm not sure that's a good idea. One false step and you can find yourself in way over your head. <laughs> it's no problem. I've been through worse. I know when to hold them and when to fold them. Do you? Barkeep, whiskey and water. Hey. Right away, sir. Boss man, I'm stepping out for a minute. Certainly. I'm assuming that whiskey and water is probably some, like, secret code, huh? See? They go out together, and he sells his guns. See? For my story, I need a sense of gritty realism. I need to get close to the action, even if that means taking risk. You will die. So here's my plan. I'm going to try buying a gun from him. Yeah. You will die. What? Anyone can just walk up and buy a gun. Ah. Yeah, if you sit next to him and order a whiskey and water, supposedly, that's the signal. Oh, yeah. That guy earlier ordered whiskey and water, too. I was skeptical at first, but now I'm convinced. I'm going to take a shot at it. Not today, but really? soon. No good can come from a civilian striking a match under criminal affairs. Play a fire, you'll get burnt. <laughs> You're worried for me? Appreciate it. Maybe next time I can interview you. If I'm in the mood. Hey, don't be that way. Tell, tell you what, though. Let's drown our sorrows here again sometime. Except next time we drink at your tab, Kiryu. 
In return, I'll tell you some stories you wouldn't believe. Okay. Thanks, man. Give me the hot goss. Alright, well, that was a weird little side... Uh, what? Excuse me? Mm -hmm. Oh, now they get hostile. No. Oh! I've never been in a fight before, but oh my god! Jesus! He's dead, man! I don't even think that we can say that he's unconscious. I think you just killed him. Like, there's no way around that. You killed him. That guy might be alive. Everybody, other two guys, dead. <laughs> Very much dead. Hey, I could go back and continue that mission. Alright, let, let me... Kasha goes here. I'll, I'll let him tell me one of his stories. Yeah, tell me a story, buddy. I'm gonna come in and it's all go, gone sideways, huh? Uh-oh. Oh, what can I get you? Where? You guys wouldn't have beer, would you? No, you do not. Uh... Give me some whiskey. Yeah, I, I don't need to know the semantics of whiskey. Do you like another one? No, I'm good. Barkeep, whiskey, and water. Yes, sir. Coming right up. Mm -hmm. Whiskey and water. Guy next to him. The gun dealer. I let him know you want a gun. You sit next to him and order a whiskey and water. I let him know you want... Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how it went last time. Cross goes to be making his move right now. Boss man stepping out for a bit. This is not going to go well. Are you a reporter? Huh? Your writing's a dead giveaway. Besides, you've been stupid around for a while, sneaking glances my way. No, uh, I haven't. It's not your hole. We'll see if you sing a different tune, minus a few white and pearlies. Follow me. Well, looks like I gotta step in. Now he's done it. I told him to stay out of it. Guess I can't ignore this. Yep, now I have to go and beat a man to death. Why can't I just have a normal night? Honestly, I'm not a reporter. Hell! I'm sick of clowns like you. Got no choice but to make an example of you. The next Joker thinks really? twice. That's enough. You were in the bar, too. What's it to you? He's my sworn brother. You mind back at all? What? Sworn brother? Then he's not a reporter? Well, at least you're no civilian. But I'll take your word for it. If you can prove it with your fists, I'll give you five seconds to regret your decision. All right, five seconds to stop. Five seconds up. Five seconds up, buddy. I warned you. Are you trying to kill him, man? That is a surefire way to break the man's neck. How about that? Fists don't lie. Satisfied? You back off, you'll back off now? Fair enough. A deal's a deal. Seriously? Then listen, about that gun. Tell me a firearm. Hey, Asuga, you got nerve. I like that. I usually don't deal with first time, but I'll make an exception this time. Yes, score. God. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. 
Yeah, they whip out a gun like it's like it's going to be the end of your life, but then you just like they they're right in front of you, so you just like grab them immediately and slam them into seven different vehicles. Here you save me back there. Thanks, man. Go on now. Drink up. It's on me. Kasuga, you got balls getting the deal done after that hairy start. That's some nerve. That's the least of what it takes to chase down what my readers want. Thanks to you, I got a killer story. How about up at arms? A frightening first-hand focus on the district's deadliest dealers. Sound exciting? Better hope our new friend doesn't read your story. Now, what do I do with this little toy? You know where I can dump it? What? After all that effort, you're ditching the gun? Well, sure. I mean, I am a law-abiding citizen. All I need is a story. That is mighter than the gun. I also don't get what makes a journalist tick. Alright, how about I gift this to you as a reward? I get, the, I get the feeling you're just dumping it on me, but okay, gratefully accepted. Thanks. Did you ever see that, um... There's a reporter that did, like, a story about, like, I think it was Russian prison camps. Something along those lines. And he was trying to show, like, what prisoners in camps would be subjected to. Where they'd be, like, stripped naked and blasted with, like, cold water, like, negative degrees. But he, he, but he strips butt booty naked. It, like presses his hand and spreads his legs against the wall. He's the man is insane. Also, I have a gun now. Now I can really kill a man. I can't. I don't think I can physically show you it. Let me see if I can at least find the video to, to throw into the chat here. Oh yeah, this game's full screen, so I can't I can't open it up. Uh that sucks. You know what? Maybe as I controller just rumbled. Maybe as like a little treat after the stream, you know? Perf cart. Where? Oh god, go away, I'm, I'm looking for my perf cart. Oh, this is such an uncomfortable angle, too. There he goes. Yeah, now you'll leave me alone to look for my perf cart. Whoa. Is that it back there? Unfortunately, it's kind of hard to tell where it is. Because I'm working in like a really tiny area. Just beat up you guys! You were gone for like 30, less than 30 seconds! And now I have to do it again! Do you see what happens? Do you see what happens? Now I have to give you a second grade concussion! First time with first grade, we're going for second! We're gonna learn about the solar system or some shit! You. Here it comes. You might want to move. I warned him. Perf card. This isn't like that really closed pharmacy, is it? No. It's not. You guys do not have beer. 
Why is this so difficult for me to just find a beer? Ah, there's a perv card over here. First, let me deal with these guys. What is that? Where are my... Oh, flyers, eh? Oh, it was just that dude? It was one guy. One guy tried to rough house with me. And I showed him what's good. Keep on ending up back in the same spot. I feel like I'm going in circles here. If there has to be a convenience store that I haven't gone to yet. I guess we can just go back and check the one over there. I know I've been here like four times by now, but uh, let, let, let me buy three things of milk. Yeah. All right, so. I've been to this store. This store doesn't have it. I don't think this store has it. Actually, I don't think I've ever been to that store all the way down there. At least I don't remember going to that store. Let me just check this store real quick. You guys were the ones with scotch. That is just another pawn shop. Okay. Okay, so I've been here, been here. That's another uh, apartment, but not the apartment store. That's just that's the drug store. Where do I find a beer out here, man?
Okay. I, I, I hate to, I hate that I have to admit this. I, I, I looked it up. I looked it up. And I'm stupid. I'm stupid. Right there. For the first time in my life, me not actually me choosing to not drink any alcohol in my life has actually had a negative effect on me. For the first time in my life, there has been a downside to not drinking. I'll probably just run there. I've been here for like an like an hour. Oh. Hey guys. What's up? Uh I'm here to intervene. You go, buddy. Anybody else? And there he goes. Never to be seen again. Don't block the street. If you're gonna reel in paint, at least do it, like, to the side, you know? Oh boy. I haven't seen, uh, Mr. Shakedown in a while. I saw him, like, walking around once and I just ignored him and I haven't seen him since. And now I've said that, I've probably, like, summoned him, you know, like, Bloody Mary. I've, I've said his name and now he has to come and kill me. And he was no more. I made it. I'm back. Thirty minutes I've spent running around looking for a beer, just for it to just be malt. The thing I've been passing over like the past four times. これで話をしやすくなったな。ああ、とも酒のおかげで口も舐めらかよ。大丈夫、大丈夫。つっても俺らが知ってることなんて大したことないと思うけど。立花不動産の仕事をしたことがあるって話だ。ああ、言われた場所に一日中居座ってるだけ。地上げの嫌がらせにさ、簡単なバイトだよ。さっきも一軒終わって、ミットをもらったところでさ、明日からまた違う場所
よく出入りしてんの見かけるよあの辺りは今地上げのメッカだなぜ小さな飲み屋ばっかだからそこの連中を追い出して一手にまとめ上げれば高く土地が売れるんだろうよ立場の不動産がチャンピオン街を地上げしているってことか多分ねただあそこは立花不動産だけじゃなくて登場界の連中も狙っているからあんたみたいなヤクザが行ったらあそこの住人たちに煙たがられるよそうか参考になったよありがとう All right. <coughs> Now we have an actual idea as to where we're going Also, let me let me put away my milk. You know, milk doesn't spoil or anything, so it'll just sit in my item box. Uh, is that is that Bacchus? Bacchus. Perfect timing. There's something I need to talk to you about. I'll wait for you back here. Oh, good, a sub story. Another one. How many sub stories have I done at this rate? Probably not all of them, but. Oh, okay. So it seems that. I can make. I, there's 20 sub stories to my knowledge. I've completed about 11 of them. I don't know if that's accurate. I might increase later. We want, were you on your way somewhere, boy? Sorry to hold you up. Yeah, you want to talk? That's right, tell me. Have you been training? Yeah, here or there. Good, because I have something I'd like to ask you to do, if you're willing, that is. What's with the hesitation? That's not like you. Truth is, I've got debt collectors on my tail. Scary ones. Yeah, I gathered. I've been running since we met. No, no, no. Those two bit jokers are nickel and dime stuff. I'm talking tunas. Famous. And I mean that in global sense. Now they're here in Japan, hot on my tail. Hold on, did you seriously try to escape your mountain of debt by fleeing to Japan? Yes. And this time there might there may be no going back. I think there's a price on my head. So I guess it's too late to pay the money back then. What are you going to do, Bacchus? Well, I was hoping I could get you to be my bodyguard. I figured as much. Unfortunately, I've already got enough trouble on my plate. Believe me, you'd probably be in worse danger with me around. Oh no, that's there's that's no way to have a heart, please. I'm sure I can pay. I can't pay a retainer, but if you protect me, I'll teach you some of my top shelf moves, the good stuff. Are these moves better than your credit? Damn straight they are. They'll do you right in a tight fight, my boy. Are you Bacchus? Uh oh. Well, that seems to be one of the men. I think they found me, boy. This is the big scary debt collector, huh? I'm here for your head. Just doing my job, so don't hold it against me. Debt collector, huh? More like a hitman. No, no. I don't want to die. Please help me, boy. Please stop calling me, boy. I guess I don't have much of a choice. If I left you here, it'd be like putting a bullet in your head myself. You stand back. Thanks, boy. You protecting this guy? For now. I don't especially feel like watching him die. I see. Fine. Maybe not a price on your head, but I'll see if I can swing a bonus afterwards. Hey. Watch out, boy. I don't like the look of this one. Way ahead of you. Alright, let's do this. Oh no, he's got a gun! I might have to close the distance so that he doesn't use his gun. I might have to really, really close the distance so that he doesn't use his gun on me. That could be bad. Oh shit, he used his gun on me. No, oh, not again! Bastard! I mean, I, that was my fault. I, I talked heavy and I got... I got shown what's good. Oi. Let it you live. You go back and tell whoever ordered the hit to forget about Bacchus. You hear me? You think I'm the only one after this guy? What? There'll be others on his trail soon enough. He'll get what's coming to him. Ah. Sorry, boy. 
Oh yeah, poetry. Sorry, biotic here. I told you to watch out for a knife in your ribs. Yeah, I am. Yeah, here I am putting you in danger myself. I did get shot in the back twice. Don't worry about that. I'd rather hear more about the offer you made earlier. Oh. What? You said you'd teach me some new moves. Better make it quick, though, before the next hitman gets here. You sure about this, boy? I don't have much choice. Like I said, I've got my own problems, so a few extra survival skills would come in handy. <laughs> Alright, then let me fill you out some moves that'll send these those hitmen reeling. Alright, tell me. What do you got? You ready to learn my moves? Yes. How do I break down defenses? <laughs> Face squeeze? The essence of face twisting. Yes. Oh, hey, there's another one. Okay, professional killers like us are always Yeah. Yes. They call me the unassailable assassin? Yeah. That's so. Alright. With the power of face squeezing. Let me squeeze that face. Wish the cat. Slip past enemies by guarding enemies' arms, grab their face, twist them to the ground. a lot of health. The power of the face squeeze. That was a nasty hit. I'm hitting the A button to do the dodge, but I'm kind of locked in the animations here. Alright, new plan. Uh, Blood Force Trauma.
I was trying to do the face grab there, but it didn't work out. Oh well. Here you go, champ. Oh, it's so meaty. And there it goes. <sighs> that face uh, squeeze thing is a little bit difficult to get, but eh. I don't get it. How'd you break past my defenses? What was the amount of second rate hitmen get taken out by their targets? You met your match today, so don't come back. I won't. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's right. I'm a big, strong boy. You're getting stronger every day, boy. Okay, it's only fun when I say that. Yeah, I guess I have to use a thank for that. Alright. I'm gonna keep learning his moves for the time being. Yes. Tenacity, huh? Spirit fire? The use of the force of an enemy blow to strike them back with twice yeah. the power. Yep, oh, here we go. We got another one. Hey. Uh. All right. <laughs> Thanks, man. Appreciate it. All right, I have I have a plan, so don't worry. Uh, it, I mean, mainly it starts with the realization that we have half health before going into a fight all about countering. In terms of a counterattack. Wait, wait, wait. How do I, how do I? Oh, God. Hold down X and Y after being attacked. Sorry, of course I have it. Ow, ow, me tubby. That's like the leg sweep. I kind of lose my ability to do that. This was definitely not one of my best fights. It was very sloppy all around. the hell you get the better of me the boy wins hey yeah what did the guy who paid you look like it was dark so i didn't get a good look at their face from the way they talk if they were foreign wow. well it wasn't me of course not it's the guy it's the guy who's have to get you but you go getting any more big ideas okay yeah i hear you I heard that these were the most dangerous deck collectors around. Looks like you hailed this one no problem, though. Actually, I kind of struggled. We better hope they're all like this, then. Do you have any more moves to teach me right now, buddy? Or is that it for the time being? Okay, that's fair. I 
do have a lot of money though, but it's still too expensive to buy any of this stuff. Because it's not like you know, 30,000 stuff, stuff like that. Or is that 30 mil? One of the two. All right, so I actually, I think I'm going to call it here. Uh, we got a lot done though. So that's it for me today. Thank you for coming. I really appreciate it. And uh, I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye.